When I started lifting, I could hardly bench 135. Barely get two reps. About a month later, after hopping on the juice, I was pushing out 315, 50, 60 reps. No problem. Now success don't come without side effects. Acne, bloating, 24-7, 365, tip of my head pulsing so hard, throbbing so ferociously. Blood pressure so high, extremely high off the charts. Eyeballs bulging out of my skull. Body and mind's brain pressure was so high, his eyeball fell out. Picked it up and put it in the freezer. What are you gonna do? Ain't gonna do nothing about it. Just gotta suck it up and push on it. Keep on lifting. So I went to the doctor last week, went to the doctor, they took my blood, did a blood test. I'm 100% all natural. Got the results right here. Old bodybuilding secret. You wanna pass a urine test. Don't use your own urine. So I use my dog's urine. So I got a little bit of my urine right here. Frick. So what we're making right here is my super cocktail. I call it super balloon. It's basically like trembolone on steroids. It consists of two ingredients. Cattle pellets. I just get a bag at the local tractor supply co. Second ingredient. It's a little more tricky. Human milk. Luckily, my sister down in Ohio sends it up. Gotta recycle. See, you just gotta mix it on medium low until the caterpillars dissolve in the milk. And it makes an HGH IGF 1 super balloon mix. Bottoms up, bottoms up. Let me see your cup. So, this is my home gym. It ain't much, but it gets the job done. You wanna squeeze at the top. Squeeze. When we come down here, it's one thing and one thing only. You're growing. If you ain't growing, wanna get the heck out of here. Instead of bodybuilding chasm. When you build muscle at an exponential rate, it happens sometimes. <coughs> My upper body's so huge. I don't need to train legs. Legs get trained just walking around. It don't matter if it's a chili dog or Rowie and the dog. Whatever I get my hands on, I gotta eat. Gotta eat big to get big. Whatever it takes. Put on 150 pounds of muscle in only 20 days. Stick like a syrup. You could put it on pancakes if you ain't careful. Natty or not. 100% not natty. My sister's milk is really foamy. I think it runs in the family. The, the foaminess. Must be some kind of, some kind of DNA anomaly. Just gotta focus.